Handshape politics. Ruto is planning to reward Baba with the plum drone as regards the Kachagua calm announces this. Hello and welcome to Kenya Secrets. If you are new to the channel, please do not forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell to be able to watch our uploaded videos. NTV has exclusively reported that President William Ruto's calm is planning to reward Willa Odinga with a powerful international job, even as Deputy President Honorable Rigati Kachagua calm is said to have unanimously packed Ruto in its ongoing effort to bring peace without creating a mongrel of government. According to the report by the local TV station as per the 9 p.m. news bulletin, it has also emerged that the Azimo decision to have Kaluzu let the talk is an indicator that Willa Ozinga is slowly handing over the mantle to the Wiper Party leader in readiness for the 2027 general election. Those aware of the development argue that Uhuru Kenyatta has fully packed the move. Elsewhere, daggers have been drawn within Azimo La Amajo coalition over the most suitable candidates to join lawmakers in the upcoming bipartisan talks to break a trust between President William Ruto and the opposition leader Rila Ozinga. In other news, the retired head of state President Uhuru Kenyatta is set to leave the country for a holiday in the United Kingdom. Uhuru Kenyatta announced the trip on July 24, 2023, when he met media editors in an interview after police raided the home of his son, Jumo Kenyatta, in Karen. Speaking to the editors, Uru Kenyatta jokingly cautioned that the trip should not be mistaken for fleeing the country. I have been at peace. I have never had a good family time as I wanted. In fact, I want to go on vacation with my children and grandchildren. Do not say I have run away. I need rest and they need me, Uru Kenyatta told the editors. At the time, Uhuru Kenyatta was responding to a question on his retirement plan after finishing his 10-year term as the president. According to a travel advisory by the Ministry of Foreign and Diaspora Affairs that has since been leaked online, Uhuru Kenyatta is set to travel to UK alongside 50 members of his family on August 2, 2023. The Ministry of Foreign and Diaspora Affairs of the Republic of Kenya presents its compliment to the British High Commission in Nairobi and has the honor to inform that the family of the former president, his royal Uhuru Kenyatta intends to travel to the United Kingdom on 2nd August 2023. The ministry therefore requests the assistance of the Extreme High Commission in facilitating the insurance of the entry visas to the following members of the former president's family. The letter from the ministry read in part, Neither the government nor the first family has revealed the period the former first family will be in the European nation. The trip comes at the time the government is set to hold by partisan talk with the opposition over the state of the nation. Finally, discords have started emerging within the Azimula Majowan Kenya Alliance coalition leadership as leaders from affiliated parties start playing blame games on the delivery score sheet of the presidential campaign in 2022 which saw the coalition lost the presidency. So a member of the county assembly, Honorable Robert, has come out strongly blaming Azimo deputy leader, Honorable Martha Kaua, for failing to deliver in last year's general election. Speaking on TV 47 Kenya Live today in the morning during the morning cafe program, Ali slammed Honorable Mata Karua for her inability to deliver the unexpected number of votes to Azimo. The ODM leader, who is also a blogger, said that Mrs. Mata Karua should stop giving stern orders to Azimo leader Willa Odinga as she is incompetent and hence not eligible to lecture ODM. As a party and as a loyal leader of the ODM, I want to make it clear that the ODM is doing a lot of work and assuming responsibility for some incompetent leaders like Mata Karua. She only gave Willow Odinga 700 votes from her constituency and she is making crazy demands. Shut up your mouth and please, you are not equal to Willow Odinga. Your delivery is so incompetency in you. So please give ODM time. Honorable Robert, quoted by TV47. Is Honorable Robert making a point here? What are your intake on this matter? Hope you enjoyed the video and please do not forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell to be able to watch our uploaded videos and have a blessed day.